there are about 6,000 people on the waiting list for land and housing at Ondangwa. There are residents who applied for land allocation and housing in both informal and formal residential areas. To address housing needs for people in Ondangwa, the council saw it fit to service extension 13 and sold it to a private developer, Comba Properties, to build houses. The council is also busy servicing extension 24 and 25 for residential purpose. And our financial capacity as a council cannot really say within one year, let's have uh, avail land for all the 6,000 people. We are uh, availing land, but all at, a, at a slower pace than anticipated or than expected by the people. But what the council is doing is trying to balance, uh, not to make it too much expensive for them. Because if we involve a lot of private uh, developers, private sectors in, that are driven by profit, the prices of land will go up. Compa properties are contracted to build 400 houses at Extension 1, ranging from two to three bedroom houses, and all of them are already allocated. As part of their social responsibility, the council is also constructing a playground where children can come together and have fun. Normally, local authorities, we neglect uh, recreational facilities, but then we decided that we don't want to continue in that fashion, I think. But we make sure that um, this open space that is within Exception 8 should be developed so that the kids will be having an area to, to relax once they, they are free.